open your Proface HMI server. If this is your first time connecting, click on Settings, Common Settings, and choose the server name and password. Click OK. Click on the Distribution Settings, and as you can see here, I've added a desktop, and you can also add another one here. But let's just edit this one. And here are clients, allow client inputs, and I've also chosen uh, an area which you can choose by using the my mouse or or take the uh, entire area or an application. So I'll click OK on this one. Next it. Uh, and then you can see the client here. There's also a clients list where you can add more clients. You can choose the client uh, name for an example, but the ID will be uh, one following with the new version of the G uh, the Proface HMI application, uh, which you can download in the App Store. Okay. You might also want to choose preferences and uh, and show the Proface Remote HMI server icon in the in the task tray. Because as you can see here, it's there right now. So when a client logs on, this uh, being OSF, this one will go green, and you'll start your Vim GP. And this is the one. Click on the link when you're mobile, and make sure you're connected to your Proface device. Click on the HMI service. OK, go back to the home screen, and start your Proface HMI application. Insert the password and click OK. Find the server. Click OK. You're now online on the application. You can go back to home, and we have different uh, for developers, for production, and so on. And you can use the touch. Go back to the home again. It is also possible to uh, just view and turn off touch option, which you do here.